in mind by a friend of mine that uh, side one that you play and I'm glad you you did participate is dedicated to the sperm in your body you see the whole thing is called a prisoner of love your whole mechanism is a manifestation of love but you're a composite of a sperm and an ovum and the first side of the tape is dedicated all the way through the endocrine system to the sperm working its way out from the matrix of the father create a father down to human father down to your own body years ago <coughs> we were looking for a way to correct the endocrine system we couldn't find any method and when Ponce de Leon left and came with his friend who did the conquest of America you know who his name is? Cortez. Cortez, right. Even he was told by the Oracle of Delphi that the fountain of youth would be in a new world but he must also look for the golden violin that will direct him to the fountain of youth. And Ponce de Leon went all the way down right up to Florida even at St. Petersburg believing he had found the fountain of youth but he could never locate the golden violin. And that was the missing portion of his manuscripts in the Fountain of Youth. What it turned out to be is that the Fountain of Youth is a timeless grant in the human body. And it does regulate the DNA as RNAs and slows down the catabolic rate of the body. But the golden violin was not known and there was no way to find a golden violin. It turned out to be a resonance frequency that an endocrine gland would resonate to once it will hear it or the body can hear it or feel it but it has to stay at a long point in time before the gland will go back to a normal function from the time you're born most of these glands are too fast too slow because of the spermal and the ovum reaction that form the body well, we don't know that until we end up with our so-called inherited illnesses in the body and different things. So for years they were searching and when I met this young man years ago, he had just won a contest. He was the last in line to receive the award and I was passing through the town at the time. And so I went there because I was invited and I saw him holding an autobiography of a yogi. So I made a remark, I said, if that's the way the way you treat your body and that's the kind of music you want to play forget about it, I don't want to waste time with you <laughs> so he said look I'm interested to shape up he says and I knew his dad was a very famous country singer but his dad was torn up and distracted and passed away and he had really ruined his health and everything but he did win the contest and he decided he was going to straighten out his life Eight years went by with the one intention to identify sonically the glandular system and get it to music. We couldn't find no individual capable of holding the hands long enough to hold the frequency to make it work. And finally one day we heard Kitaro's music on the synthesizer. And we said, hey, this may be the instrument, this may be the golden violin that could hold a note long enough and they experimented and for sure his cousin who was a doctor retired became interested because he was actually zeroing in on some facts about the human anatomy they made a tape and one side is all the songs that are dedicated to the sperm and the other side are all the songs dedicated to the ovum many people who hear it because of the conditioning of music this is not a musical piece in the sense of music. It's designed to do certain things and it ranges in three ranges of volume. Extreme high that can make you very <laughs> hypo. Extreme low that can be very, very hypo. And then it comes back to the middle where you normally operate. But this was taken from the glands themselves, how the 
operating people who were ill, and his body was ill, he had to clean up. So when I went to the, con the concert the night when they did the recording, I met the mother again. She said, I don't know what to do to my son, but the both of you look so young, and I'm still old and hopping out. But he's turning on to this new music, and I'm slowly dropping off my age. And she's busting around like what you did to the, in the room, and happy person. And she's up in her 70s, 80s. And what she did look very good. I'm going to try and take you through the music, so you get a reference to the parts of your anatomy. So, we're going to play the... sperm side first and then I'll take it to the ovum. Okay. See, a loser can't be born. Hmm. And it's the only one that is here in this room that got to the ovum. And the ovum can't be used twice. And these are facts. The measurement is in sonics. Now, concentrate on the base of your spine. That's what they call in the yoga center, uh, uh, knowledge, they call that the chakras, or in the pain center. The base of the spine, or coccyx. That's the sperm part of you. Stored up in that. any symptom that your body may want to do. Scratch, yawn, stretch, don't fight it. That's exactly what the body is correcting. A, a trauma from a sonic passed down through the father to himself or, or through your body as it comes out to form. So wherever you feel something, just go with it. It's a form of a sonic colonic. <laughs> you get rid of sonic junk.
This next one is in the genital organs. Now there's a code going through that music, like that thumping song in the background. And the code is, I only have time for you. Not time for you. But not you saying it to God, it's God saying it to you. He has no other time for nothing else but his creation. But generation is from creation, the organs that form life. So I only have time for you. So with that, in essence, feel your beingness, where your sperm came from. All he has is time for you, nothing else. It corrects all the problems in those areas as you focus on it. It starts to pull them back in balance. next one is your navel, but here I want you to picture the most beautiful convertible paid for fur lined. Most expensive, but you own it. So don't think in any terms of paying for it. It's paid for, it's in your mind, it's a convertible and it's fur lined. And you're gonna drive it out. You're out now, so get behind the wheel. <laughs> the 
the most expensive thing you can think of, the most beautiful, it's all paid for. Never supposed to co-signing. No, no co-signing, it's paid for. It's four lines and you're behind the wheel right now. And you're driving out of the town. And you're gonna go for a railroad track. So if it's a Mercedes or a Rolls Royce. <laughs> You got a scarf around your neck and you can wait to be sitting the bag. What you're doing, you're driving to a grove. So let's keep going over this, out of the city, over railroad tracks, to this beautiful grove. And we are in the grove, there's going to be a big lake. So that's where you're going and that's your destination. at the lake. And it's sunset. And the stars are coming out. And there's a harvest moon shining in the sky. And you're getting out of your convertible to step into the lake. Right down to the top of your head. The fountain of youth right in your chest.
now the moon is a spaceship, it's going to let down an elevator for you to climb on board. Mm-hmm. You're climbing on board. You're going up. And you're taking off into the time warp. Through the galaxies. And the Milky Way. coming out from the music in the background it is saying I am happiness
right here, the elemental kingdom is cleaning up your brain, between your left and right brain, of all the misapplied decisions, the past, the present, and the future to come. So let them clean up the brain. Get ready for convex vision. <coughs> if you hear broken glass, that's the thing. All ideas going out, you're cleaning it out.
Now this is the saints come marching in, communion of the saints is a reality. They're coming in to prepare the place for the Lord. So you can see the Jacanda's vision. Like a spotlight shining down on you. Now, there's a code there. All initiates know the code. It was given to them on their five fingers. Non initiates repeat, I thank you. Recognize the code. It was given to you at the initiation on your five fingers. Yeah. Now listen to the music. The non initiate the only repeat, I thank you.
our next size is going to be the ovum because we are composite of two principles the sperm that gets to the ovum is a winner but then the ovum has its own rhythm all by itself in your body and it has to do with it. all the cerebrum and upper portion of the brain that's why it comes last because you're going deep down into yourself. Like you're in a huge big tank. And that's the base of the spine. You're working your way up. lives in its ivory tower. All the gentleness, all the purity, all the qualities are in God. There. 